एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल तो टुडेज टॉपिक इज टर्नरी ऑपरेटर तो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी व्हाट इज टर्नरी ऑपरेटर एंड वी विल सी द यूज केसेस ऑफ टर्नरी ऑपरेटर एंड आफ्टर द एक्सप्लेनेशन वी विल डू सम हैंड्स ऑन एग्जांपल आल्सो वेयर वी विल रिप्लेस इफ एल्स स्टेटमेंट विद द टर्नरी ऑपरेटर सो प्लीज वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल द एंड so that you can have better understanding what is ternary operator and how we can use ternary operator in the place of if else statement if you are new here please do like this video and subscribe my channel so let's jump into it when we talk about the java language in the java the ternary operator is the only conditional operator that takes three operands okay so it's a one liner replacement for if then else statement and is used a lot in java programming so we can use the ternary operator in the place of if else conditions or even switch conditions also so using nested ternary operators although it follow the same algorithms of if else statement so the conditional operator takes less space and helps to write the if else statement in the shortest way possible so so we have a our variable here and we will have three expression expression one and expression two and expression three in between expression one and expression two uh, here is a question mark sign and in between expression two and expression three it is a colon so this is a pretty much a structure of ternary operator so let me tell you how it works if the expression one is true in that case the resultant value for this variable will be our expression two uh, what if the expression one is false then in that case the resultant value for this variable will be our expression three so let me repeat if our expression one is true in that case the resultant value of this variable will be our expression 2 if the expression 1 is false in that case the resultant value for this variable will be our expression 3 so let's see what is next this is a syntax so pretty much uh, i already explained so we have a variable and we will have three expressions and in between expression one and expression two uh, there will be a question mark sign and in between question uh, expression two and expression three there will be a colon so this is uh, nothing but pretty much a structure of ternary operator so let's move next so this is the pretty much if else statement how the if else statement works in the case of if else, if else statement our expression one is true if our expression one is true in that case the result will be our ex expression two okay otherwise if expression one is false okay in that case else part will be executed you got me okay then let's move forward and i think uh, uh, we will see some examples so i'm just opening my id which is i'm using eclipse so here uh, here is a example where i used if else so we will replace this if else statement with the ternary operator okay so uh, let me explain what is this and, and then after that we will replace if else with the ternary operator here we have uh, if else statement where our first condition is if the time is uh, like is less than 18 18 means uh, in the case of 24 uh, over clock 18 means here is six o'clock if time is less than six o'clock then uh, we want output as a good day uh, otherwise uh, it will be good evening so let's change the input like uh, suppose it's uh, two o'clock okay and when we run this yes good day it is working and suppose it's uh, 
nine o nine o'clock in the evening then in that case we want good evening yes i uh, i think it is working properly so uh, let's replace this with uh, ternary operator so we will simply do this and delete this and simply okay okay and our condition first is like uh, if the time is less than 18 then our question mark and then our second condition and second condition in the second condition we want to uh, output like uh, good day okay so that's it and let's write our third condition expression so semi uh, colon and then we want good evening let's remove this and then terminate this and after this we will simply just print what we want to print result okay so let's change the input like uh, it's uh, one o'clock in the afternoon and in this case what should be the output output should be good day so let's check mm, yes yes the our output is good day and let's change it with like 8 pm then in that case we want good evening yes it is a good evening then i think it is working so this is the pretty much explanation and the use case of ternary operator so this is how we can uh, replace if else with the ternary operator like uh, here uh, our first expression is uh, time is less than 18 and in between first expression and our uh, second expression there is there will be a question mark sign and in between expression two and expression three uh, here is a colon so this is the pretty much uh, structure of ternary operator and this is how it works so if you find this video informative please do like this video and subscribe my channel and thanks for watching